17 September is celebrated as Social Justice Day in Tamil Nadu as a tribute to social reformer and founder of the Dravidian movement, Periyar E. B. Ramaswamy. But is today's Tamil Nadu the world Periyar envisioned? Periyar once said, Marriages should culminate on account of the wishes of the couple. It is their knitting of the hearts that should lead to marriages. On 6 January, a 23-year-old engineering graduate who belonged to the most backward caste, Marduvar, was hacked to death in broad daylight. The incident happened in Karur, and the crime was allegedly executed by the family of the girl he loved. In 2016, 23-year-old Shankar, who married Kausalya against the wishes of her family in 2015, was killed by men hired by her father. She belonged to the politically powerful Devar caste, and he was a Dalit. Between 2013 and 2017, 187 cases of honour killing have been reported, of which 80% of those who were killed were women says A. Kadir of Evidence, an organization that works on caste issues. But activists say that this is just a conservative estimate. Many cases are often labelled as a suicide and sometimes go unreported. Is this the world Periyar envisioned? Periyar once said, Man treats woman as his own property and not as being capable of feelings like himself. The way man treats women is much worse than the way landlords treat servants and the high caste treat the low caste. The National Crime Records Bureau's 2020 report says in Tamil Nadu, the rate of crime against women has gone up to 17.4% from 15.6% in 2019. Crimes against children in Tamil Nadu have also gone up from 4,139 cases in 2019 to 4,338 cases in 2020. Periyar stood for emancipation and empowerment of women, 50% reservation for women in employment and education, and believe that women should be liberated from the kitchen. Now let's look at this picture. This is not a boys club, but the Tamil Nadu cabinet formed by the DMK in 2021. Of the 33 ministers, only two are women. Is this the world Periyar envisioned? Periyar once said, only education, self-respect and rational qualities will uplift the downtrodden. Periyar dropped his surname Naikar, a caste name, to show his stance on caste discrimination. But again, Look at NCRB data. Crimes against scheduled castes and scheduled tribes in Tamil Nadu have gone up from 1,144 cases in 2019 to 1,274 cases in 2020. On 14th April 2021, 21-year persons allegedly killed two pariahs or Dalit men. The reason a petty argument, but it exposed how the Dalits have been facing caste discrimination for years and even today are marginalized. Is this the world Periyar envisioned? Periyar once said, Wisdom lies in thinking. The spearhead of thinking is rationalism. Periyar's thoughts are often rooted in social justice, rationalism and anti-Brahmanism. But then look at this. Former minister Selur K. Raju launched an innovative method during the acute water crisis of 2019 in Tamil Nadu. He placed thermocol sheets on the water to curb evaporation. The unconventional idea turned out to be a disaster as the thermocol sheets placed on water were swiftly swept away by the strong winds. Let's take the case of Dr. Simon. Dr. Simon of the New Hope Hospital in Chennai has helped hundreds of patients in his lifetime. But he was denied dignity in his death by the same residents of the city thanks to uncontrolled rumours of COVID-19. Be it COVID fear or rumour mongering, Periyar would not have approved. So, is this the world Periyar envisioned? Periyar once said, For how long are we still to remain Shudras and allow our progeny also to be Shudras in this world? Should we not do something to attain human dignity, devoid of our ills, at least in this generation, during this age of science, of scientific freedom? Over the last decade, Tamil Nadu has gained notoriety for its increasing manual scavenger deaths and failure to prevent this inhuman practice. As many as 206 manual scavengers have died while cleaning septic tanks and sewers from 1993 to 2019 in Tamil Nadu, according to a government survey. The number of deaths is highest in Tamil Nadu among all states. Periyar dreamt of a society free of caste, slavery and poverty. Is this the world Periyar envisioned? We are truthful, unafraid and independent because of you. Now you can help our reporting from the ground. Go to the quint.com, click become a member tab, choose a plan and pay. Because the truth is worth it.